uh, learning a new skill or craft isn't always a cheap thing to do. Between the cost of the class and the price of supplies, the money can add up fast. But this fall, you can catch a break. And 12 News reporter Shannon Slatton explains how you can take advantage of free classes in today's Money Saver. There's a great opportunity coming up at Hennepin County Libraries this fall. 70 art programs that are absolutely free. A little bit more orange. Tina on Otmar from Artsy Smartsy specializes in teaching seniors art. And you're going to tie up your silk scarf with these little knobs. This silk scarf art project, so you can really do any colors you want, is perfect because any experience level can do it. I've had people in class that really did only have um, ability in one hand and they did this perfectly fine. Tina will be teaching about silk scarf painting in an upcoming class at the Brooklyn Park Library. The library system seemed like the perfect opportunity because we do receive a lot of phone calls often for seniors who don't live in senior homes that are in the community living in their homes and they still want to be part of an art program. Besides silk scarves? And you only want it in the bag for a few seconds. She'll also be teaching about pop art and mosaics too. After it's dried I remove all the little rubber bands and then I'll show you what the final product looks like. But seniors aren't the only ones that are a part of the library's fall arts series. We have increased our arts programming because of the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund. It's allowed us to work with a lot of community partners to offer high quality arts programs that are free for the community. At the end of the class, you have knowledge and a new piece of the art. Is where the white is, is where the rubber bands were. After these are nice and dry, the folks will use these and they can just put them around their neck and make a nice little spring scarf. And of course you can still sign up for several of these classes. Go to the Hennepin County Library website and you can link to that one through ours, 12.tv. All right, thanks Shannon.